Hey guys, uh, this is my first video. Very exciting. Okay, today we're going to learn how to convert exe files, which are Windows based, into, sorry, here we go, exe, into DMG, which run on Macs and OS X. So, first thing we're going to do is download a program called WineBotLock. We're going to go into our browser, mine's Google Chrome. Put this in the description. It's winebottler.cronenberg.org and it runs Windows based programs on a Mac. So you choose whichever OS X platform thing you're running, and I'm your 70, so I'm going to click and we're going to go download. This is going to pop up and they're going to try and scam you, so don't fall for it. Um, and over here to the right, we're going to click skip ad. And it'll pop down here, oh, depending what browser you've got, I guess. And it'll start here. I've already downloaded it. So, I'm going to stop that. No, I don't want to open it. Cancel. I'm going to go out. So, this will pop up to wherever you are probably in your downloads. So, we're going to double click, open that up it will look like this. We want to click this, drag it into your applications. I'm not going to because I already have it. And wine. Put that in there. Once that done, when that, once that is done, just leave them alone. They you don't need to open them. Um, with your exe file, go to right click, so control and click. Open with wine so that's my default if yours isn't it might not work so do right click it open it up all right we are going to convert to simple osx application bundle with wine bottler all right go this looks extremely confusing um Basically, the only thing you need to worry about is this app bundle section. We want to make it self-contained so that if you don't have wine, the wine app in the future, it will still run. And that's all. Click install. I'm going to call it, oh, I don't know what to call it. in my applications, original, save, down here, oh, didn't like that, it will pop up, and just let that do its thing, this will pop up, and, I'm not sure if this will work actually, with that application it wasn't working, all my other ones it has, there we go set up that and then it will have an icon and be able to open on the map and there you have it hope you've enjoyed my video um oh look there's more ah stop it and like and subscribe and message me for any other videos you'd like to see Thank you.